Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name's the same. Uh, so guys, uh, as you all remember from my last video, I'll be now talking about Islamic videos, Islamic stuff. I will be posting a few, um, you know, funny videos that I usually post. But for now, I'm basically just gonna stop gaming videos. Yeah. Anyways, also guys, I wanna apologize once again, like I've always been doing for not uploading as frequently because as you know i am now getting very busy these days with you know my own stuff and yeah so i will uh, try my best to upload videos every time i can yeah also guys so in today's video i want to talk about respect so i want to talk about all about respect how we can improve it the benefits of doing respect so respect is something that mm, some of us lack. I, I'm not going to lie. I sometimes also do lack respect. But most of the times, I try my best to respect everyone. All right. So if you guys don't know what respect is, respect is like treating your elderly or people with utmost, like treating them in a good manner, treating them well, taking care of them, being kind to them and all the stuff, hel stuff helping them yeah yeah so that's respect and s some of us nowadays now generations like for example my generation we tend to lack that respect and that is something that all of us need to fix because if we show respect to everyone respect everyone even our elders our youngers be kind to them do whatever they like if we respect them allah will be very kind of like allah will be very pleased of what we're doing and inshallah or we will uh, receive lots of good deeds we will receive lots of good deeds and who knows we can even go to in the judgment day in the afterlife we can even go to jannah for that where we can meet all our family and everyone we know so guys it's very important to respect everyone and even when you don't respect always make sure if you don't respect the person and you're being like you're treating them in a unpleasant way treating them in a way that they don't like also guys sorry my camera keeps and i have to fix it fix it yeah keeps drifting away anyways so like if you don't respect anyone treat them in an unpleasant manner something in a way that, that they don't like allah will not forgive you unless they forgive you first so you should always ask for forgiveness from them first then allah will sure forgive you if Allah permits to forgive you, yeah, because on the judgment day, this is something that my parents used to tell me when I was young, that on the judgment day, for example, Allah is going to ask other people, like, are they satisfied how we treated them? Do they forgive us for what we have done? And if they do, Allah will forgive us as well. Yeah, that those are like basically the advantages of forgiving. So, I wanted to remind you all to all of you guys to keep respecting everyone you know, respecting everyone who help you. Also, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam or Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam once said this quote or hadith. Guys, I, I'm sorry, I don't know it word to word. I remember I found this I think from Google or like a a worse. Yeah, it's like whoever does not respect the elderly or the younger one, younger ones is not from my nation. Which means that we are always have to respect our elderly and the younger ones. Also, guys, I'm sorry in advance if I didn't say the words or hadith or quote properly. Because um, I think I read this uh, like quote, like I don't know, one month ago. And I've been really planning to make this video. But I've been getting busy with my stuff. So, yeah, I apologize if it wasn't like word to word. But I, I hope you got the concept of what I'm saying so yeah guys that's it for this video uh yeah so that's it for this video about respect comment guys comment down below uh what what topic you want me to talk about next next we'll probably talk about uh, uh i don't know some manners and stuff also guys one more thing did you know that when i was in school one day when we had the subject islamic studies we're like we talk about is islam and all that i forgot to add this do you know my teacher said that there's one thing that is better than I was praying, reading the Quran and like all of that. 
you know what it was? It was kind of like not breaking the other's heart and reconciling others. If you guys don't know what that means, that means that when two people have a fight, for example, two people have a fight, and then, for example, one person says that, oh, he, mm, for example, he's a good teacher, but I just don't like him or something like that. Then what if you go to that teacher and tell him that person said he's a good teacher? Like, reconciling is making a relationship. For example, two friends fight. And then you make them friends again by telling them good things about each other and stuff like that. So that's also really good, which Allah will be very pleased with you. And you'll get lots of rewards. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Also, don't mind this. Um, I got a cut. Anyways, please make sure to like and subscribe. Smash the like button and comment down below what I should talk about next. Assalamu alaikum.